Oh, Jesus. You all right? Piece of advice. Sleep with this guy all you want, but don't get attached. He's not a challenge. Say it with me. Not a challenge. He is a lost cause, destined to be a bitter, lonely old man. Speaking from experience? Observation. I've known this guy since school. I wouldn't touch him then. Why would I want the older, less vibrant version? Are you bad-mouthing me? Mm. Just words of wisdom about how evil and cold-hearted you really are. Don't worry, honey. You can still change. Is Bill attempting to kill you yet? You want me. Should I just go? Oh, no. Please. I didn't mean to fuck with you. I'll be quiet. Impossible. So, when is your shift over? I'm closing. So when is that? It's a weeknight. You get out early on weeknights, right? Come back about midnight. Oh, sorry. I'll come back later then. She seems to be fabulous. When's the wedding? Drink myself. I had a ridiculous day. Hey, I uh, thought you were gonna do the laundry tonight. Yes, it's your turn. What? I did it last time. No, I did. Remember, the lady took the dryer from me, even though I had the laundry bag hanging on the handle. I can't hear you. I'm in the hallway taking the damn garbage out. What? <laughs> Okay. Okay, yeah, I'll see you in a little bit then. Okay, I love you too. Bye. Of course, you're in a bar. Of course, you'll be too late to do the laundry. I'm gonna fucking kill her. Then, I'm gonna wrap my hands around your fucking throat. Laundry? Shut up, Mr. No Future. Yeah, you're right. I should settle down, go to work every morning with the herds of undead and business attire, and argue with my wife about whose turn it is to do laundry. I'm not talking about my misery compared to your misery. I'm talking about health insurance, 401k plan, neither of which you can have slinging drinks. Yeah, well, I'm prepared to make that sacrifice. Don't slip on your way to make me another. You'll never pay the hospital bill on the tip I'm going to leave you. Don't you have laundry to do? Washing clothes is not to be done sober. I was hoping to get rid of you. You haven't hit on me yet. I came to get my ego boosted. Yeah, and to ruin mine. Bring Bill next time. I miss that guy. He doesn't really drink anymore. He used to get so loaded in school. Stop right there. There will be no college stories. I've heard them all. I was there. I'm trying to forget. You just don't want me to bring up that night. I remember nothing. Oh, what a night. Late December, back in 93. Make me my drink. And you choose Bill over me. It's a math, really. Bill's been around for five years. You were what? Five minutes? I've taken craps that lasted longer and were more satisfying. Five years and no ring. Something's holding you up. What is it, beer? Can't see yourself getting old, my main man, Bill? I don't want to talk about that. 
That's fine. Let's move those five minutes. Straight for the pizza guy. Gotta look straight. Hi there! What do you want this? I don't. Right here? Is good? I ordered a pizza. Who is that? It's a gift. I brought two of them for you, but you can only have one of your gifts. Mustn't be greedy. Get out. Nice dicks. Looks like we're alone, huh? Look, you're in the wrong place. I don't know nope. what... Right place. Is, is that person dead? All these questions are very confusing. Jesus, give me a moment to explain. Police, call him now. What's your name? Bill. Hang up the phone, Bill. Why didn't you say you had a gun? How you doing? It's moving around. How are you doing? Not very good. Bad day, Bill. You're pointing a gun at me. That could be adding to it, but the real cause of your bad day is woman trouble. There's really no denying that. I saw you earlier. You are a frustrated man. Are you going to kill me? Kill you? No. I just met you. Please leave. I won't tell Can anyone. Can you be any ruder? <laughs> Do you always ask your guests to leave minutes after they arrive? I come bearing gifts and, and you still want me to go. Don't kill me. What? I just said I wasn't going to. Unless you want me to. Do you want me to kill you? Don't want to die. 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 Bill! I don't want to die. Get her out of that blanket. Unwrap her or you're dead. Okay. I'm unwrapping her. This is ridiculously exciting. Can you feel it? The excitement? <laughs> Stop! Oh, I know you! It's the woman from upstairs. I know that. I got her from there. I'm sorry. He has a gun. He's crazy. I am not crazy! I just think differently. What is this about? I'm not gonna tell you until you take back what you said. Okay. You're not crazy. That's better. Will you shut up? Don't hurt her. All right, you hurt her. You kill her or I kill both of you. Remember I told you I brought you two presents. You never asked where in the world your other present was. Well, it's in here. Hot steaming lead tearing through flesh and bone. Not as pretty as that little package, but Bill, it's one or the other. You see, she dies no matter which way you push it. You have a chance to live, though. She's not seeing anything but this room for the rest of her life, regardless of your decision. Come on, just kill her. You better hurry, she's getting away.